was squeaking weasel stranglers welcome back to monkey boys toys welcome back to the sofa today we've got something uh, a little bit different um not that different but a little bit different um we've got a box opening uh, i've ordered something from nerdzoic.com out in the states so i'm very excited to get this um this has been on pre-order for a, a little while now but um once i got the uh, notification of postage it really didn't take very long to get here at all maybe maybe a week so that's not bad all from uh, the states um, so without further ado let's get into this and see what monkey boys got today shipping label let's remove that I don't want to dox myself at the moment um, okay let's reveal what we've got let's see if I can do it without giving it away immediately can anybody guess what this might be some of you might recognize the packaging immediately um, it's very nicely packed I must say so very happy with that hopefully it'll all be intact let's just slip this tape at the top let's have a look what we've got we have got the DC deceased Supergirl and Superman figures let's put them right to the back so that we can see them oh, oh, that was a bit of glare on them but there we go it's Supergirl and Superman um, in their zombie forms um, let's have a look at the a look at Superman first. There he is. Box is in good condition. Um, got a little image of him on the back there, uh, and a little write-up which you can, which you can pause and read if you wish to. Just telling you a little bit about the uh, about the character there. Um, he's not quite the same as the promotional images that were sent out. Um, those images he had sort of. Um, painted um, sort of slash marks fingernail marks on his on his outfit there um, he doesn't seem to have those but there he is he's looking very cross uh, with his with his face a look at my face so he's got some blood spatters down the front of his chest there and and there he is. So I do like I do like a bit of Supergirl and Superman. Um, I've decided to get these to go with the with the collection. Obviously they're not vintage. These are these are brand new out this year. Um, but um, but anyway, and here's Supergirl. She's looking very pissed off. Look at my scowl. So there she is. Um, again, this figure doesn't quite have the same amount of rips and tears in her outfit that was that was shown on the promotional images. Um, sorry about the glare there. Um, I've got one of my lights up because it's not quite bright enough today for this. Um, so we'll have a look at the back. And there's the image of her on the back. Um, another write-up. That's the same. It looks like it's the same write-up as on Superman. Um, her eyes look particularly vivid there. <sighs> um, yep, yeah, they're pretty vivid on the front. Um, I don't know if she might have a bit of a wang eye going on. I'm not sure. I suppose it doesn't really matter if she's got a wang eye, being as she's sort of zombified. Um, but anyway, there's uh, there's the DC Direct Supergirl. And Superman, really glad to have those in the collection. So they'll be they'll be going on display in the box because I'm not an opener. I have ordered two more of these from Big Bad Toy Store. Uh, not sure when they're going to arrive. They don't seem to have them in stock yet. Um, Nerdzoic came through with these very very soon, so I was really happy with that. Um, when the ones from Big Bad arrive, I may open those and display them. Although. 
given my OCD, I might well keep those in the box as well. Um, because I'm special. But anyway, there we go. Um, Superman's groin looks a bit groiny. Um, those those sort of paint apps on the on the top of the legs, obviously meant to to mimic his um, his his pants or whatever that whatever those red items that he wears are. Um, I'm not sure it's that great overall. I think they could have done a better job with that mould um, and maybe moulded the the shape of the the red um, garment a little better and then had the legs coming from from underneath that I think the um, I think the mold could have could have done with a bit of an alteration I believe this is the um, it, it's uh, it's basically a, a repack of the DC um, essentials or um, uh, whatever figure um, with the exception of the hands and the and the and the head um, the rest of the figure, I believe, is the same as the previous release. Um, but it would have been nice to have have a slightly better crotch um, because he looks a bit a bit peculiar with that with that strange strange crotch. But anyway, Superman's strange crotch aside, thanks very much for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed it. Give a like and subscribe if you haven't done so already, and we'll catch you on the next video. I'm going to flap off now. See you later. Bye.